So we are at the palace here in Jodhpur and it's beautiful. Welcome to room 109. Come on in. A nice little entrance way here with, I do believe, the king or the king's son who built the palace. For sure a member of the royal family. Member of the royal family. Then we go into the room. So for larger parties or larger families visiting, you actually have a large wardrobe. So you have a nice area here. They give you an umbrella, you have your shoe shine kits, all the, the extra luxury things that you find in a luxury hotel. So they have a few robes. In here they have um, two robes. Then you'll also find some in the bathroom. But that is the wardrobe. Here you have the bathroom, which is very lovely, like most of the other things in the palace. You have, see, like even the sizes, you have a, a large moisturizer bottle, and these are all like beautifully made accent containers. You have toothbrush, toothpaste, makeup mirror. And this is a unique thing you don't find in too many hotels. You have a clock. This is a Taj Hotel and the actual royal family still lives in a portion of the palace. Over here you have hand wash, tissues, Q-tips, cotton balls, coarse marble floors, and then in here you have the toilet area, a beautiful shower, beautiful shower, lots of towels. And this is a great thing too, having the towels um, in the shower so you can dry off after you've turned it off, a rainforest. And all of your products, shampoo, conditioner, and shower gel. And then these are another set of robes, which these are super cozy, beautiful robes. Something again, a little different, um, which you don't really find in a lot of hotels. They're like a terry cloth, chenille kind of robe. Just a beautiful robe, super soft. Out to the main area, which has your bed area. It's actually a queen bed, so it is not a king. You have a little Satay or couch at the end of the bed. Big screen TV. And let's see what we find in here. Have your mini bar. All of the regular things you will find. They actually have a lot of alcohol selection in here, as well as a chocolate bar and some chilled glasses. Nice little touch. They have a coffee press. Of course, they always have water. Next to the bed here, you have another clock. Normally it's an alarm clock, but this is like a nice little fancy clock. So you don't, you don't normally find these types of clocks. You have like, you know, a digital alarm clock, but this is kind of a cute little fancy clock. Obviously, they always provide you with water. Earplugs, they seem to have those in all of the hotels in India, earplugs. Bedside lamp. And then you have a USB right next to the bed. And uh, if you don't, don't want to use the lamp, you actually have here a universal plug. And then all, all of your you know light switches that operate the lights in the room. Coming around to the other side of the bed, 
you have, of course, you have more, what is this? You have a disposable bag. I'm not sure what the disposable bag is for. Um, a little notepad. Inside you have another USB plug. Down here below you also have a universal plug. And again, should you choose not to plug in the lamp, you have two of them. Okay, so the bedroom area, and then you have a desk here, which is actually where they do your check-in. You come to your room and do your check-in, which is a very uh, cool, unique idea. You do, do give your passports um, in the front area um, when you come in, but you check in here. At the desk, you have another universal um, plug, so you're set with there. Again, if you don't wanna plug in the lamp, you have another one. Additionally, they have for you here a map of the palace. It's the map of the ground. So this room is actually, you come through here and we are over here. And the um, royal family actually lives in this area over here. So they actually have quite a small section. So you have access to all of the palace while you are here. And then they also leave you a list of things that you can do um, when you're here. Everything from a tour of the palace, you have cookie making, you can go see the horse stables, there's billiards. I mean, there's a ton of things to do here. So you can kind of see that. And you have some writing paper, which is always pretty. You can send something to someone because not too many people do that anymore but check out this postcard you actually have a postcard of the palace and then you have this cute little key they give you it is like a solid brass key um, which is very cute here you have some more writing pad they also pro provide a converter going from the Indian country plug to whatever plug you're using from your country. So that is sitting on the desk in this cute little bag. And then finally, and, and also you have a huge large mirror, basically, if you want to stand um, here, you can almost see in the bathroom mirror too. <laughs> so here, spinning around from your doorway, you have a full length mirror and these curtains actually open up into the courtyard area outside. And then you have a little seating area here. You have lots of magazines if you wanna read. And then, uh, you know, two, two chairs. They leave you some snacks over on the table, um, some fruits and a little bowl of water with some, with a little petal in it, a little rose petal. So that is the room. Even the lights, lights are pretty too. It's all done very lovely. Let's go to dinner. Ooh, look at this beautiful courtyard. Lit up at nighttime. Headed to dinner. Should we go to the inside restaurant or the outside restaurant? Let's see what they have. Thank you, sweetie. Oh, it's so beautiful. Beautiful restaurant. I think we might get some good service. The only ones here. Walking through the halls of the palace. It's pretty beautiful. Yeah, sure. Yeah, it sounds great. Perfect. Sounds nice. Sounds great. Yeah. Yes. This is like our own private dining table over here. I love it. How was your dinner, sweetie? My dinner was delicious. Good. It was like a good kind of slow step back into real food in the United States. 
Very <laughs> exciting. <laughs> funny meeting you here. Funny, funny. <sighs> Let's go. <laughs> So get a pillow menu. Turn down service. We have our slippers and they're pretty blue. And look at all of this. We have a cool little horse and a bunch of other stuff. All of the things you need to clean your clothes. We have a pillow menu. Awesome. And we got a letter telling us that they got top 50 best hotels in the world. Okay, sweetie, hello. Good morning to you. Hello. We're doing some breakfast okay. at the palace. Yes. With lots of Lovely pastries. Ooh, what kind do we have? All the chocolates. Ooh, these are like jellies. That's, those are good. And we got some yummy things here. We got yogurt. Snum -num. All beautifully presented. And then on the other side, we have juices. Fresh juices. Milks, yogurts. Lots of different cereals. Lots of nuts. And then you have your fruits. You got some dragon fruit. And they also have a nice selection of meats. We have a crazy amount of birds flying around. Good morning from the palace. Good morning from the palace. <laughs> Your breakfast has arrived, and we have the most cool puffy omelet. Check that out. But the interesting fact about this omelet is it's described as a flat omelet. Oh, okay, that's kind of funny. It's a Spanish omelet, which is a flat omelet. Okay, well, either way, it's pretty cool. Yeah, very cool. Okay. Okay, so now that you've broken inside, we do have... Like what amounts to souffle. Right. Without any flavor. You know, like, okay, right. like the, it's not chocolate souffle. Or right, right. Oh, okay, man. that's cool. Okay. It's white, fluffy, delicious, egg white souffle. Okay, that's cool. All right, Nikki is inside the palace finishing up. We're off to our next location. I hope you've liked our review. Hit, a, hit that like button, subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And definitely you want to stay here at the palace. Yeah.